They needed this uh, scarecrow that somebody's got in the garden in England. So, somebody's had a, gar uh, a garden, a scarecrow in their garden of Michael Jackson. <laughs> They've got like a proper with the thriller suit on and everything else, the curly hair. Unfortunately, he's got a black face as well. But they were the police. Somebody's um, complained about it, and the police have called them up and said they have to take it down. So they said, "What is it? Because of the black face? You know, because it's meant to be Michael Jackson. That's why we've built it. But we will take the face and change it to a white face if that's what you want." But no, it's the suit. We don't like the thriller suit, so or the red suit that it's got on. So you're going to have to take it down. And they're like, what? I don't fucking understand. But the police forced them to take down this Michael Jackson statue. So they've put up a village people one instead. <laughs> they put up fucking six extra ones of all gay guys, all like, you know, with the fucking uh, the, the Red Indian hat and the helmets and all that kind of stuff. So, you know, they just bended the rules there. Did a fucking, you know, if you can't have Michael Jackson, we'll have the village people. What are you going to say about that? <laughs> And they could just keep changing it because they'll get a complaint to somebody. They'll have to take it down and they must be ready with the next one. What's the next one going to be? Um, Bono or somebody like that. He's a scare. He'll have fucking scare the scarecrows away. <laughs> just play Bono through the scarecrow, you know, screaming out fucking one of his, uh, one of his hits. I mean, you two from the early days, they were good, but, you know, just fucking put one of it, put him in a black le all in one leather suit. <laughs> And get him singing like, I can't think of a Bono hit now, but put it this way, it'd be enough to turn the mosquitoes away or anything else. The hornets, mosquitoes, spiders, worms, <laughs> ants, they'll all fuck off out the garden if Bono starts talking. That's what I mean, not one of his songs. When he starts talking, giving the righteous one about the, you know, um, about the planet and uh, what what he's doing good for the world and all that kind of stuff. Although he means well. <laughs> he's got a... Uh, worms won't be on board with it, I'm afraid. The worms will just take off. They'll be like, I ain't listening to that shit. You know. <laughs> Who's he to tell me what to fucking do with my money when he's a fucking multi, multi, multi-millionaire tax dodger? And the worms have got a point, to be fair. If you go, you know, if the worms have got a point. <laughs> and if the worms leave... That's it, the garden's fucked, for starters. And they're going to take all the, uh, what's it called? All the uh, all the birds, they're going to go because there's no, there's no worms to eat. So it's fucked it, there's no bird song. All we've got then is Bono to listen to. That is no fucking way to live, I'm afraid. So let's, let's, uh, let's, let's not have the Bono statue, let, let, uh, Scarecrow. Let's just stick it with the let's just stick with the village people for now because that's a lot of fun. Right, said Fred, who I mentioned yesterday, that'll be a good one because that music's so shit and cheesy. Everything will fuck off again. <laughs> Everything will leave, but the worms will probably stick around because the worms will just find it. You know, they'll bob their little worm head to it. They won't understand that it's uh, shit pop music. I think worms will be on on board with it. What am I talking about? I'll tell you what. I've not even had a drink yet, but I feel like I think the sun's gone to my head. <laughs> I did see a worm earlier, that's why. It must have just popped into my head because this is all just off the cuff.